All right, guys, so this is the order. We've got it packed up pretty good. Oof. I don't know how much is there, but I'm excited. That is crazy. All in all, at the end of the day, this comes out to... Good morning, Bear Squad. Is everyone ready? Look at this. Can you see the ice? It's negative five. It's cold. I love it. So we've got... Oh crap, this is still here. I got stuck this morning. Get out of here. All right, this is the biggest run I've ever done on camera. I've never done one this big. We have eight stops, seven snack machines. Let's do it. Hey guys, so this is something I normally don't show on camera and it's actually my first time using the tablet to do this, but you should always get your mileage when you're going. Uh, so. I've got Vensoft pulled up here, and uh, you can see I dropped in the beginning mileage and the vehicle that I'm running. Sorry, that's really hard to see, but you should always track the mileage when you're on your runs. Let's go get some product. All right, guys, so this is the order. We've got it packed up pretty good. It was uh, a little over, what was it? I can't remember now. I think it was a little over 100. Let's see here. 124.44. I've already got it pushed into Vensoft and I bought a whole bunch of new bags because I didn't have all the bags that we needed and I didn't want to waste time so I just bought them. <laughs> waste of money, but whatever. All right, so we've got the soda packed in the back. For some weird reason, Walmart didn't have Sunkist. Uh, so we're gonna go over to BJ's and get Sunkist and Monster real quick. Later. All right, so we're now completely done shopping. We've got everything. I gotta admit, this took longer than I thought, so we're gonna have a really, really long day. Let's get to it. All right, guys, we're at our first stop. Let's go ahead and load up the car, get in there, and get this done. All right, so I've gone through, got everything done on the tablet with Bensoft, and now I need to go through and do everything in the MoMA app. Machine is full, ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this sucker right off of here. Just pull it right out. So. See our Diet Coke is completely gone. They love the Diet Coke. So with this one, we need to use the Vensoft and the MoMA app all at once because we can't count what's in there. Now before we leave, that light is out. So we're gonna go into the comment section on Vensoft and we're gonna leave a comment that that light's out so I don't forget. All right, it is, what time is it? It is 11 o'clock and we just got done with our first out of eight stops. Gotta pick up the pace a little bit here. Let's go. A few moments later. All right guys, it's 11.10. We're at our second location. Let's go ahead and hammer this out. All right, this is what the cart looks like. Let's get in there and get it done. Here's our machine. Everything's looking good. Pretty empty. These protein bars did way better than most places. So this was a learning experience for me. I did not know that these bottles needed to go up, upside down. These bottles vend fine right side up, but these will not. All right, so the weight of cans makes it so you have to have these rails on there so they don't, so the coils don't pick up. I found that out the hard way as well. All right guys, we're done here. We're gonna go to our next stop. It is currently 12.06. We've got a bit of a drive ahead of us, so 
We'll see what time we get there. Let's do it. One eternity later. All right, guys, it is 12.43. We just got to the next location. So that was a pretty good drive. It was a good ways. Uh, let's go ahead and get set up, get in here, and get it all taken care of. All right, guys, here is our setup for our tire warehouse location. Let's go ahead and go get this full. Bam. I've already done some work here, but this is pretty down. We're gonna go ahead and fill everything right up. Got everything in our tablet and our phone. Now, let's see what we got. Pretty decent. Go oh, yeah. Man, this looks so much better than it did. We pulled out all of, like, we had a crazy amount of Cheetos in there. You can see them all over there. But uh, we've got it all switched out. It looks really, really good now. Uh, these guys really like their grandma's cookies, so we've got it loaded up on grandma's cookies. We've got the better Pop-Tarts coming in. Uh, we're gonna leave this coil empty. We pulled out the Fig Newtons. These guys want Crunch Bars. So I was gonna put 100 grand here, but we're gonna go ahead and do Crunch Bars on the next visit. All right, time to have some fun. So this is gonna be really small, because I was just here yesterday. Yeah. We've got a new board in here, credit card reader, all that good stuff. So I took the money out of the old bill acceptor. I don't know how much is there, but I'm excited. Oh, there's more money in there, look. Ah, yeah. Bam, all right, dude, we are done here. Let's move on to the next one. All right, it's now 2.07. We got a long drive ahead of us. Let's get to the next stop. All right, guys, it's now 2.53. I am 100% certain we're not gonna make it to one of the stops. So we're gonna skip the next stop after we do this one. And hopefully we don't miss out on any more. So it's gonna be seven locations today instead of eight. Let's get to it. Okay guys, so I upgraded the motherboard on this and I couldn't figure out what a problem was. This was upside down. So I flipped it, got it right now. Everything seems to be working. So I'm actually gonna be at this location a bit longer because now I have to program each column again and make sure everything's working properly. So this could take a minute. I'm gonna get it done. So this is pretty empty, but I'm not actually gonna fill it. We're probably gonna come back another day and do this. I'm gonna go ahead and get a count on this because now we can use telemetry, which I'm so pumped about. That means we've only got two machines left that need telemetry upgrades. All right, so I'm pumped. This thing is reported cash now. Now we just gotta fill this sucker up and move on to the next one time ever I'm doing three rows of the same product guarantee you it's all gone soon all right we're getting close here got the third one set so this machine's been completely redone at this point uh, we've got a whole bunch of different products in there we've got a couple of empty holes that we've got to figure out what we're gonna put in there I had different products in different places it was kind of a mess so I fixed it we're good to go Let's see what we got So I just got finished up here. It took way longer than it was supposed to. We're gonna wait until next week or next Monday to service the rest of the machines. It'll still be in this video, but 
I just ran out of time. It's like five o'clock. The next location's 45 minutes away and they close at six. We're just not gonna have the time to do it. So we'll pick up where we left off so we don't miss any locations on Monday. We'll see you in a couple seconds. Good morning guys, it is Monday now. It's a little past nine at this point. I lose a lot of time in the day because where I live, nothing really opens till 9 a.m. 8 a.m., daughter goes to school. I have to wait till nine before I can do anything. Go to the bank, now we get to go to Walmart, we get to go to BJ's, and then we can start our route. And then around two o'clock, we have to stop our route, <laughs> go get daughter from school, and then we'll finish our route afterwards. Let's get to it, guys. What's up, guys? So it is about 10 a.m. We're gonna go ahead and hammer this location out. I'm pretty pumped because it's been a little bit more than a week, so this is gonna be really solid. All right, so working on the snack machine here. Uh, I guess this column here and this guy here didn't vend at one point, but uh, no one filled out a slip. So we're gonna go ahead and refund the guy his money and get a slip as well, just so we can keep track of it. Alright guys, so we have a couple refund requests here, so I'm going to go ahead and fill these guys out and uh, put them in envelopes and give them to the office. Overall, I'm pretty happy with the way everything went at this specific location. Um, the refund receipt things or the refund requests are being used. I got the requests back to people, the machines are full, everything seems to be working. We're not spilling change anywhere, which is great, uh, so we know that problem is solved. Let's move on to the last location and then head home. I lied, we have two more locations. We're gonna move on to another location, go pick up my daughter, then go get the last location. My bad. All right guys, we're here at our second location. We need to really rush this through. Uh, it's a little past one right now and we're about 30 minutes away from my daughter's school. So we need to get this done and get it done quickly. Let's do it. All right, that's everything. All right, let's grab this sucker. Look at this today, guys. I've done an all right job of keeping the van not entirely a mess. Hey guys, so we're all done at, I can't remember if I recorded or not. We're all done over there at uh, our car dealership, our Subaru dealership. I'm hanging out here at the school waiting for my daughter to get out. And then we're going to head back down to the same area and we're going to service a mechanic shop. That's going to be it for the day. I'm really excited to be done with this whole run. I really wish like I could find a way to run the entire route in one day. But like it's one of those things where if you miss one location, you're going to start missing all of them because they all like 
they all close at a certain time, except for one of them. One of them's open 24-7, but that's the one that I do last. All right, guys, we'll check back in with you when we get to the next place. All right, so we are going to be pulling all the chocolate out of the machine because it's getting too hot in there and reorganizing everything. All right, we've got this all cleaned up. It's looking great. Uh, we did remove all the chocolate stuff and only put shelled stuff in here so it doesn't melt. It's good to go. Bam. That's $1,000. <laughs> no, almost 100 though. Oh, that's so much more colorful. There's so much less orange now. It's awesome. A few moments later. Oh, that was quick. Uh, didn't like that at all. Oh, there is one stuck in there. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> unplug it. How do you do this? You unplug it. That is like weak. <laughs> okay. This worked so perfectly the last time. What did I do differently last time? This thing's a monster. It's so it's so much faster. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So we've got this awesome bill counter. I've actually already ran the first thing through a couple times, and uh, I should probably clear it out. This thing's a monster. It's just like, oh, it's nuts. It's really really fast. It's it's ridiculously fast. So I'm gonna get the tablet ready because I have to put everything in Vensoft. Then we're gonna start the coin counter and then we'll run this and wait for the coin counter to do its thing because it's gonna be way, coin counter's gonna be way slower than this is. That is crazy. All in all, at the end of the day, this comes out to 13 something. 1381.70 before credit card sales. This is freaking crazy. I'm pretty excited to go deposit this. Oh, it's nuts. So with credit card sales, the credit card sales are $256.30. That puts us at a whopping 16.38. For this collection it's absolutely nuts 12 machines we missed a machine we had another machine we could have actually uh, collected on dude what a great day all right guys that is it for today's video thank you so much for tuning in i really do appreciate it remember to love life and live your dreams peace out bear squad